We will be traveling across North America in search of the best teenage soccer players. They'll be picked in order to compete for a single position at the Everton Youth Academy. This is their chance to go pro and earn a six-figure contract. Only one of these skilled athletes will survive the final cut, but most of them will endure the frustration of failure. How many of you would scratch people's eyes out and take everything to be a footballer? You have to live it. You have to breathe it. It's got to envelop you. But that's my life. It has to be your life. Get on the ball! Our talented soccer experts are Steve Niger, Jason Messa, Bassam Name, Hubert Busby, and Ray Hall, manager of the Everton Youth Academy. It doesn't matter how good you think you are. It only matters how good we think you are. This is the dream. I'm coming to see if we can find the play. Are you the one? Good morning, guys. Good morning. I had coach one time, man. That's a place cleaner than this. Really, guys, you gotta try and keep the room tidy in this. I mean, Put things away, keep them in your bag, and if we see anything on the floor, it'll go in the garbage. You know what, let's do that right now, I'd say. Put it in the garbage? I'd say, I'd say we do it. And then these kids, I don't know how many times we have to tell them. Any stuff on the floor, I'm gonna take it. And going downstairs. I meant that one. I said this as well. All this, going in the garbage. What we do with the garbage? Hey guys, put your stuff away, you make sure it's tidy. This wouldn't be acceptable anywhere else, you've got to keep your rooms tidy. Okay, my rooms had all that stuff thrown outside. Really? Yeah? No way. Let me see that. Team Umbro seems to be getting used to living in the comfort at the House of Champions, but for Team Top Notch, it was another hard night in the Oz Dome. Where did you sleep last night? And uh, in, the, in the bubble. I was sleeping in that dome, a cold dome. Ah, uh, it was so cold. It was cold, very cold. I didn't like it so much. It was real cold. It's freezing. Uh, it was hard to sleep. The ground was pretty hard, and uh, I slept uh, very, very bad. Ah, uh, it sucked. Want to sleep there again? Oh, hell no, no. For the losing team, things are going to get worse before they get better. Top notch. Team Top Notch cooked my breakfast this morning. We lost last night. Again. After a tough night in the Oz Dome, Team Top Notch has to make the winning team's breakfast. For some of these guys, it looks like it might be their first time in a kitchen. Push it down. Pull it down. But the team manages to come together and get the job done. The garbage today. I'm good at cooking breakfast, but I don't, I don't think I'd want to cook for everyone right now. We had to make the other team's breakfast. Something we had to do, so we lost, we, we lost again. Uh, the breakfast was good. I don't know how they cooked it, but it was good. Didn't get me sick, so they didn't do nothing to it. I'm not throwing up yet, so it's all right. Um, I didn't try it because I needed to play today, so I wasn't up for that. Just fruits. It was, it was good. It was good. Surprisingly, it was good. Not bad. They did, they did a good job. Give them props. They had eggs, everything, and surprised they cooked it. It was alright. Nothing special. Potatoes are a bit burnt and over-seasoned, uh, over but I think they're trying to fatten us up, slow us down for the game tonight. Next game we have to win, though. We can't afford to lose. After cleaning up, Team Top Notch hits the field for an intense workout. These players know the next challenge is the most important yet. Nobody here wants to lose again today and spend another night in the Oz Dome. Well, it was uh, a lesson learned the hard way. Uh, I'm out about it. We should have lost yesterday. I'd rather not lose, but maybe give us some inspiration to pick it up a bit more. It's, 
it's our fault, man. We lose, we go down, we gotta pick ourselves up. We gotta work hard for each other and hopefully we'll get the result. I, I don't like losing. I, it happened, but it was a learning experience. I, I don't wanna go back again. Okay, players, now let the old guy show you how it's really done. Coming up next on Soccer Dreams, is there trouble in paradise for Team Umbro? But there's a couple of guys that I know that have some problems with their attitude. Why go back? Why go back? You can do any, any goal. And today's challenge gets both teams fired up. Buddy, you had an extra guy. No, man, no, 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 it doesn't matter how good you think you are. It only matters how good you think you are. This is the dream. I'm coming to see if we can find the play. Are you the one? It doesn't matter how good you think you are. It only matters how good you think you are. This is the dream. I'm coming to see if we can find the play. Are you the one? I don't think we just need to work as a unit, maybe gel some more as a team. We did some uh, team bonding stuff, we ran our own practice, so it was uh, pretty good. I think we'll do a lot better. We did a lot of gelling the team, just talking, and we did a little kind of get together practice. So we know each other a little bit better. We all know each other's names now. I think the team will just function a lot better. We learn how much, uh, a little bit more each other. Then uh, we know how the people play. Now we have to play closer. Uh, we're gonna just fight hard. Work hard, help out the team. First, we gotta start off by winning the game today. We're gonna play hard, play like a leader, run the whole game, not stop. I think today that we're all going to win because everyone on our team wants it because last night we all had a rough time and uh, we really want to go back to the house. House is pretty nice. Helps give us more motivation to win. It's hot inside and it's cozy. They got the swimming pool and weight and stuff. It's nice. It's pretty cool. Yeah. It's pretty nice. I'd rather, much rather sleep in there. And after today's game, that's where we're going to be. We're going to be in the house and then going to go try out the Oz Dome. We haven't lost, scoring goals, and we've only allowed one goal. There's no problems in the team, everyone's getting along well. But there's a couple of guys that I know that have some problems with their attitude. I could, I could tell for sure. For example, uh, I'd say the Logan guy, like the one that's just kind of just got in trouble. Why go back there? Why go back there? Why go back? Why go back there? You can dribble any, any goal. Why go back there? So we're supposed to name names here? Um, that little guy, Tutu. Me, personally, I think Tutu is probably the weakest one. The little guy, Tutu, he's, he's got heart, like he tries, but sometimes uh, it's not enough. I, I don't have no one particular I would cut. He's got some problems with his attitude. He carries the ball a lot. Probably say Mario, he's kind of not running back. He's kind of staying up and not passing the ball a lot. Everyone's doing good. I think the way I see it. He's been working hard to get back, so he's been covering up for some mistakes. Hey, why do we need to dance on the ball and give him time to set when you can do it first time? Right? Having all that, look at me, having all that technical ability buys you time and space, but you don't need it there. Right? You don't need it there. You did well to get the first touch, great. And then you took another, took another, they close you down, we lose possession, they go the other way. De Santos, like he's got amazing skill, but he's out of shape and he doesn't work hard and uh, he holds onto the ball a bit too long. I think that's gonna hurt him in the long run. You have that ability on the ball, superb, right? And that gives you time. The first touch, smooth, second one play. De Santos, he's too much fancy. He's like Cristiano Ronaldo on the ball. Instead of just making that quick one-two and run off the ball, he has to put the little touches and... You're taking three and four and you're dancing and piddling, right? 
not needed. I have to say I'm a bit myself because I'm a, I took a couple of too many touches and I would like to improve that. Everybody on our team is giving 100%. I think that's the best they can do. I think Alex is, is top. He plays in center half with me. He's been good. Nick is, is really solid in defense and, and Alex, they're both solid in defense. I think it's Latoyan Anderson. When I first came into the house, I saw a few kids outside and they're juggling the ball, doing a few tricks, and that got me a bit antsy. And then after when I saw them play on the field, I was like, blown away, they weren't as good as they were when I saw them the first night. But game situation is different from juggling, obviously. I like his form, I like the way he plays, when he plays off the ball, when he plays on the ball, where he looks to pass and his vision of the game. There's a lot of players, I couldn't just, I couldn't list them all because there's a, a good 10 or 15 who I think will definitely make the cuts and could all potentially be the one. Nobody's a threat to me. The threat is inside my head. Everything's inside me. If I can perform to my full ability, overcome all the intimidation and do play my game, I shall, I shall be the one. It doesn't matter how good you think you are. It only matters how good we think you are. This is the dream. I'm coming to see if we can find the play. Are you the one? I, I, I think my team is going to win again. I'm just saying. I picked some good athletes. I think they're going to win again. If they don't win, I'm going to run him even more. Sam said. Both teams have gathered for today's challenge, the pull competition. First up is Team Umbro to show us how it's done. Touch the duck point. See, I told you you need rhythm to play this game, son. See, need some rhythm. Eating grass, that's right. That's right. That's right. Eating grass, no cheating. Come on, lads. Come on, Umbro. Come on, boy. Try and give him a little gas. And make sure you put the clutch on for the next group. Let's break it. Be feeling the grass. Let's go. Come on, Abby. Come on, Abby. You're going to beat him. He's on his knees over there. Some thief or some top notch. What's going on? I'm going to talk to the coach for some. Is that what you're teaching them boys? How to thief? Yeah. There we go. Come on. Come on. This one's got some rhythm. Down, down, stay down. You have that grass. Keep going, keep going. Hey, 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 hey. What are they doing? Your chain, chain wasn't attached. So pulling, uh, you gotta pull this thing now? You gotta do it again. Put that hand up, coach. Put that hand up, coach. Good, go ahead. Oh, oh you didn't wait, hey. You didn't wait, hey. Like, like, what? what? What do you mean, man? Buddy, you had an extra guy. No, man, no, no. No, no, no. Okay, give me five extra guys. I'm saying they got a couple. But you put your hands on me. Don't touch me again. Hey! We already won anyways. Don't for these guys. Third day in a row. Coming up next on Soccer Dreams, it'll be the coaches who have to decide this controversial challenge in a tiebreaker. The one up there was a sabotage where they purposely went up there and unhooked it from my boys. Oh, it doesn't matter how good you think you are. It only matters how good we think you are. This is the dream. I'm coming to see if we can find the play. Are you the one?
doesn't matter how good you think you are. It only matters how good we think you are. This is the dream. I'm coming to see if we can find the play. Are you the one? Today's pool competition certainly provided plenty of controversy. Buddy, you had an extra guy. No, man, no, 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 no
Watch out for the net, man. I don't know what's going on, but I, I, I picked some good athletes. I think my team's gonna win the game. I'm just saying. Yeah. Hey, you're my keeper, and you give me that ball. What? Right? I'm gonna give you. Ball here, put me under pressure in here, and you know that ball ends up in the back of your net. You gave me a 50 50 ball here, it ends up in the back of the net, and you're gonna give me for it. Right? Step, son, step, 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 step. Too close in, give it some depth. Now play! For top notch, it's finally their chance to move into the House of Champions. After sleeping on the hard Ozdome floor for two nights in a row, these players have earned a good night's rest. We'll see how long their stay and their reign as champions will last. They say you live once. So I live once to the fullest. Respect the game, respect the name. A day to the free block, I'm giving them pain. I was king of the streets, until they put me in chains. I got the heart of the game, so I'm a boss of the game. I did my time in the game, yeah, I'm ready to die. I got my for the streets, a lot of pain in my mind. Nobody can stop that, I did the rack. Hit the ready to die, you hear the sound of the Mac. Nobody can stop that, I did the rack. Hit the ready to die, you hear the sound of the Mac. Train the day to sequel, money's the root of evil. Dying is guaranteed to so live my life to free. Lord, I came from the ghetto, even murder with metal. If you heard it together, you see the reason my mental. Going through pain, if you insane, then we the same. The brother's side of the time is dark, it's only rain. I was born a poor boy, mama and four boys. Shacking inside the little room, mama can bring joy, so I turn corrupt.